brand new video today guys it's going to be a new series so guys i'm going to bring to you over Mars's road to glory so basically guys the whole series is is that it's just i have prime over Mars obviously carrying the team basically over Mars is going to be our captain obviously because it is over Mars's road to glory and obviously his prime card is related to his arsenal days yeah that means that i'm gonna pick a premier league side let's go straight into the team so guys our main objective is obviously getting to 200k and i'm just gonna guys show you the team and i'm gonna play one game today and then yeah that's gonna be the video done and maybe i might do it on thursday but uh, a proper full video so guys starting off with um begovic right he's probably the most op goalkeeper in the game right now he's like he's six foot six and he's just incredible like i've won most of the games with him and he's just he's just amazing like if you want to get a sweaty premier league team or a cheap premier league team get begovic he's like 900 coins as well uh, which is really really good his safe techniques traditional is all right preferred foot is right and he's just an outstanding goalkeeper when you play with him in the game in the center back it is uh cesar asplia Quetta, obviously i got him as first owner so basically counts that obviously i can get him uh, he's played 48 games for me and two assists which is all right for a defender and He's just good in total, really. Uh, his, me his player work great and his defensive work rate is medium. His preferred foot is right foot, and and he's a fast and and a really good defender. He's got a bit physical as well, but now in centre back is going to be Antonio Rudiger. Um, he's he's really he's really physical on the ball and obviously trying to get the ball. He's played 32 games for me and he's, he's scored three. But no assists, but he's got um, six yellow cards, but that's in there. But yeah, now left back is going to be Informatically Young. I've done it on the um, path, no, not path to glory, the Black Friday SBC, so that's why I got first on his untradeable. Uh, player work rate and his defensive work rate is medium. 83 pace, 85 dribbling. It's alright for a left back. Probably the, f yeah, it's, it's good, but it's physical linked. That's right back in his Hector Bellerin. Obviously, you need to get Hector Bellerin. He is probably the fastest. He's the fastest left well, right back in the game. I think he's the fastest defender, like fastest defender, normal card in the game. He's amazing, literally amazing. And 95 pace, uh, 75 um, defense, which is alright, but all we need is the pace. So, starting off in the sentiment is Bakioko. Obviously, you need to get him in a cheap Premier League team. He's about 6k, um, he's played 42 games for my team, scored four and assisted four. I don't know how he scored four with the with the 49 shooting that he's had. But yeah, he has 81 defending, he's got, he's got the stamina, he's got the physical. He's an all right player to be honest, except for his shooting. But I don't think his shooting is not too bad when you play with him. And it's Yaya Torre. Uh, four star weak for three star skill moves. Um, he's really physical, 92 strength, that is amazing. Uh, his finishing, his shooting is alright to be honest, um, 82 finishing, shot powers 86, penalties 89, um, his defending is 70 but you only need physical and a bit of defending. The passing, obviously you need that for a midfielder and I think he's the perfect player. Tens attacking mid is um, Manuel Lanzini. He is a pretty good player as well. Um, he's not even pretty, he's just outstanding. Uh, preferred foot right, his player work rate and his defence. Defence and attacking is medium. It's 5 for 6 so you can't basically win headers with him. He's not that physical but he is good at dribbling. He's pace as well but all i need now is the pass and i need to upgrade on him so guys the right ring is raheem sterling he cost me about 1.9k um his player work rates attacking and defensive is high mediums preferred foot is right three star weak foot four star skill moves sterling is is really really good you probably liverpool fans will say that get salah but um i play well for sterling and yeah, his dribbling is amazing. I know Salah has more, but like I think I'm really good with Sterling. Acceleration, 80, uh, 94. Spin speed, 92. Yeah, he's good. Striker, Antonio. You need to get Antonio. 
82 physical like he's probably he's probably the perfect player maybe as well like i might keep him he's 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 really op acceleration 82 but sprint speed 87 dribbling 83 not too bad uh his jumping 84 and plays for west ham he's he, he played 32 he played 32 games and scored 32. That's how good he is. Well, maybe anyway. He costs about 850 coins if you want to get him. But yeah, he's just good. So there you go, guys. Here's the big man, Mark Overmars. He has, yeah, guys. He has the exact same pace, um, pace stats as Hector Bellerin. 96 um, acceleration and 94 sprint speed. And then Bellerin's is exactly the same 96 acceleration and 94 sprint speed um overmars is really good at dribbling he's 90 dribbling 90 foot uh 90 dribbling ball control reactions he's got it all but his penalties are and free kicks are terrible with the um but yeah his icon profile see after joining arsenal 997 overmars settled into his new team well and his pace dribbling quickly made and problems take notice in particular his form and goals in key matches during the later part of the season were crucial to Arsenal top and Manchester United to win the Premier League. They later secured a double by winning the FA Cup where Overmars scored an opening goal in the final. This was topped off by a man of the match performance in the 1998 FA Charity Shield win. So um, yeah, let's just go for one quick match and it is going to be against Run and Ole, real friend and Ant's team. So yeah, so you're probably thinking, what difficulty do I pick? Um, usually on these big um, on these big squads, I usually pick for world class, but then the rest of the games I play legendary. So yeah, I'm it. Yeah, so let's go straight into the game. So guys, there you go. Here's gonna be the game. And let's see who we play against. Let's see the team. And they have an OP team. They have in from the here, the prime card, Real Ferdinand, Dani Alves, Hero Messi, which he has 99 dribbling. Uh, Ronaldo, a striker, Neymar, it's just going to be amazing and a tough game to play with. Now there's Rudiger on the ball. Now to back Yoko. Then to Torre. Torre plays it to Lanzini. Lanzini through balls it to Sterling. And Sterling unfortunately hits the post, which is unlucky. It should have been 1 0. And after that, De Gea kicks the ball straight to, I don't know who that was, Rudiger Torre. Lanzini plays a 1 2 with Antonio. Lanzini um, through balls it to Overmars, and Overmars just got denied there. And still, there's um, a chance, but yeah, yeah Torre um, messes it up. But we get a corner now and let's see where that goes. Can we score? But no, we don't. They're here. Saves their fair and square. Now they have the possession and at Michael Antonio um, tackles them. Now to Overmars. To Sterling. They play a little 1-2. And a great ball from Overmars to Lanzini. And that is 1-0 to us. Deserved. Um, we were dominating that game. You know, it was 12 minutes and I show, I'm showing you those highlights. Yeah, we were dominating the game. Uh, Ronaldo had a decent chance here with his dribbling. Pogba played a through ball, but Ashley Young um, intercepted it perfectly. And now, Bakioko's um, pass leads it to Antonio, I think. And yeah, we have a free kick. Uh, Yaya Torre, he needs to smash the top bins, but unfortunately, it just goes out. Um, just goes and he just skied it but yeah um Bakyoko wins another header is going into the 45th minute almost half time and unlucky by Antonio great dribbling there he was so creative and straight after that Bakyoko wins the header again but unfortunately it is half time half time the score is 1-0 and yeah Ashley Young plays uh, a ball to Overmars, then to Antonio. Antonio goes to the left wing. Uh, Yaya Torre back heels it to Overmars. Overmars just got the flat, uh, um, and blocked, and Sterling uh, scored. Well, deserved it as well. Because, yeah. We should have been like 5 0 up, but obviously that's the way it is. Great goal there. Great team play, and lucky by Overmars, should have got a goal there, but Sterling finishes off in the top bins. Pretty good as well. 
Um, Neymar now he's really dangerous on the ball and it is now uh, full time because there was after that goal there was literally nothing there was literally n nothing um, in that game it was just me passing the ball that was it but yeah Overman's got man in the match with 9.2 he assisted one 100% um, on his shots on target and his passes not quite with, with the dribbles he hasn't got any crosses but yeah he done pretty well um, and he, he's the key player in our in our squad and the key player to the series and we have about exactly 1800 points and that leads us to silver three i think yeah silver three and um yeah i'm gonna play some more games and hopefully hopefully um i'm gonna win all of them and try and get to elite one or elite two but yeah that's about it guys i hope you enjoy the video i just want to say like thank you guys for all the support lately please make sure to like subscribe and then yeah guys peace